Hey guys, it's your girl Lena back with another Eat With Me video. This time around I have a taco soup concoction kind of thing and I know it looks like a lot but on the bottom there's rice, white rice, and then I have garlic knot. Um, have you ever heard the saying when you were a kid by your mom or somebody in your family you eat with your eyes. Um, <coughs> excuse me, my sinuses are messing with me. This is what this meal is. Is ease is is. Um, I put too much food because I'm not gonna eat all this. So I got some aluminum foil here because what I don't eat is going to be dinner tomorrow. So I made the rice and I made the taco soup from scratch. I googled the recipe and with every recipe I make I tailor it to my taste buds. So of course I did not make the naan. I bought it from, from Food Lion. But I did buy a cast iron skillet because I want to find a recipe and I want to make it. I love naan. Steaming. So let's eat and chat. Um, but let's let this cool down a little bit. You know, this, I'm not gonna eat all this. The heck was I thinking? Jeez. So how was your day today? It is 9:35 p.m. I'm eating very late. It's not good to eat this late, but I'm starving. Haven't eaten dinner. And if I go to bed without eating anything, I won't sleep very well. So, we had our Christmas luncheon today. It was fun. It was a great time. Did have a doctor's appointment today. My wrist. But um, I had to have a CT scan because um, I have Kingbox disease. Kingbox, whatever, right here. I don't know. If you are a doctor or someone in that knows what that is, please. Uh, I, I googled it, but I'm still like, okay, so how can it get better without surgery? Because when I googled it, it looks like the only way for it to get better is with surgery. And I'm sick of surgeries. Um, but I would like to discuss this whole uh, <clears throat> the whole Pete's depression video that I made and then the Nutter Mission Talk response. Guys, I done got duped. Duped, gooped, blooped, shoop de duped. Man, I should have known. From the pros making videos about her all this time it was all to make money she done did a click 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 enter I'm back at Nodders didn't I say in her response that they would be back together like in a few days and listen <sighs> that's just I'm sorry Mm -mm. I'm gonna buy a new TV. I'm gonna do di -di 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 -da 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 -da. Uh -uh. That's still very hot. Uh, I couldn't. I'm not like those mukbangs that it comes right off the skillet or oh, still bubbling in there. I can't do it. And talk about it, talking about mukbangers. Let's put Chantal and let's put her in our boo pocket because <laughs> I don't have pockets. Do you all like mukbangers or do you like to watch ASMR, ASMR mukbangers? Uh, I, I like to watch certain mukbangers. I don't like the mukbangers that do heavy ASMR. Like the ones that like do the 
like I don't have nails so you can't hear nothing um or the ones that like whisper I, I I'm here to see here to eat um I don't that's not my cup of tea if it's your cup of tea hey you like it I love it I don't particularly care for the mukbangers that chew with their mouth open I do love B loves life but I, that is only so much I can handle because of the open mouth joint. But I love her. Um, but I can't. I can't handle open mouth chewing. Uh, I can't. I, I particularly don't like to watch people that are so over the top with the moaning and like this is the first meal in in God knows how long and it's like. They sound like they're having a sexual act. Those, I, 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 I'm like, eh, yeah, um, this is not for me. I'm sorry. I'm going to just go to something else. I, I can't do it. I, I can't do it. I'm sorry. I, I just can't. And mock bongers that just... And just shove their food in the face and are like super, super, like super, they just eat like disgustingly. I don't know if that makes sense. Like, bro, breathe. Sis, breathe and nobody's sucking your food from you. But some people that I really like, I, I, I try to watch the content and and if it's some of those things that I don't particularly care for, like I'll, I'll watch some of it, but that I like space it out due to that in particular reason. Because I'm like, ah, you need your mouth open. Oh, you're like moaning like you're in the bedroom, like, not like, mm, this is so good, mm, this is so good. No, like, excessive, like, I'm talking about ex overly excessive kind of thing. Not like just a simple morning kind of thing, yeah. Bro. Everybody has their faves. Are you bringing me a gift? Yeah. Oh, thank you. My older cat, she likes to bring me, I bought her Hello Kitty small plush doll. And every time she just brings it upstairs or she brings it close to me, and she wants to bring me a gift. But she's an asshole because, excuse the language, she's mean to the middle child, the middle uh, cat. She's so mean to them. They always, they pick on each other, and but she, when it comes time to eat, like, come on now, leave her alone. Why you got a 2K puncher when you're about to eat? There's no need for that. Hmm, sorry. I had a hole in my lip. You don't have to 2K puncher when you're about to eat. It should be a happy time. You don't have to eat. But going back to Chantal, um, you know, I hope Pete is going to get actual help because he's always said, even before this, stupidity um, that he's had depression issues that he sees someone he can talk to and Chantal went back to matters it's only a matter of time before they're back 
recording lives together. And Natter is just a user, just like Chantal. It's crazy because I watch a lot of, well, I watch certain, like, Kesley Christians, the YouTube Underground, and a couple others. And I thought this time, hmm, could this be the time? Could this? Hmm. I, I, I knew that Chantal was going to go back. But I actually believed Pete because I suffer from depression and I've been uh, um, in the past so severely depressed that I thought I was never going to come out of it alive. And that's why I actually believed him. And I have friends that didn't come out alive. Stupid me for believing him, for giving him, not believing him, but giving him the benefit of the doubt. But you should always give people that voice, those kind of things, the benefit of the doubt, because you never know when they're going to do something. But with those jokesters, it's like the boy who cried wolf. When they, something really something serious happens, nobody's gonna believe them, and that's the unfortunate part. That is the unfortunate part. When something like there's a health crisis, or you know, I hope it doesn't happen. That says a health crisis in Chantel's life because, let's be honest, just because she's eating healthy, healthy queen, doesn't mean she's taking care of herself. Let's be real. If I ate this whole bowl right now and I went to bed, that's not good for my health. Spending days at a time awake? That's not good for your health. Uh, you know, was, there was some, there's some study that if you spend seven days straight awake, you go insane. I don't know after how many days you start to develop, uh, what's that word? Hmm. Um, hallucinations if you spend I believe three to four days straight no sleep whatsoever y'all can correct me if I'm wrong you start to after I eat this last piece of naan I'm done eating because I'm getting full um, you develop oh my sinus is hallucinations because the body needs sleep. It doesn't have to be quality sleep, but it needs to rest. Your body needs to rest. Your brain, your body, your entire body needs to rest. Um, the, the whole anima sleep have to sleep. You don't need quality sleep. You just need to sleep. She just wanted an excuse. Like he said, that's the, another thing I believe. That's one thing I believe that he said, and I said in my video. Because he said, hey, take your stuff with you when you leave, and she's just left. That was an excuse for her to come back. And that's one thing I believe. She just wanted an excuse to come back to pick up her stuff and her CPAP. And that was her way to go back in. So she went back. And now she's back in his house, recording and editing his videos. Miss, oh, that's an old video. I don't believe that.
There's no such thing as in too deep. You can love somebody with all your heart and soul, but time heals all wounds. Time heals all wounds. You just gotta give it time. She's not allowing that. She keeps going back. And get your switch back, bruh. Like, come on now. I don't picture Nodder playing Switch. If you actually took the Switch, like some people are speculating, go bring that stuff back. Stupid that. Go get it back. But yeah, I don't believe that she, this was all planned. When my dumb butt, my dumb ass got loop de loot. But I'm, I mainly got looped you with by Pete. I'm not sure I'm talking because I knew she was going to go back. Because to me, when somebody talks about being in a deep depression they feel like they're not going to come out of, that's nothing to play with. Anyway, let's move on to a different topic. So this taco suit has... The recipe called for stewed tomatoes and then chilies with, you know, the can of stewed tomatoes and then a can of diced tomatoes with chilies. <coughs> Excuse me. I just used two cans of diced tomatoes with chilies. And... Excuse me. Mm. And the corn has chili beans, pinto beans, black beans, which were added today. Corn. I made this with ground turkey. I don't eat pork and I don't eat beef. It is not for a religious reason. I went, I tried, I attempted for a year to go vegan. My kids were very young at the time, so they didn't want to do a weef. 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 They didn't want to do it with me, so I went back to eating meat. But I, at that time, I was eating pork and beef. But when they eliminated meat, I only, when I reintroduced it, after the year I gave up meat, I gave up dairy I gave it all up no way for some reason I had an obsession with ice cream and Papa John's cheesy bread I, for some reason my body could not give those two things up but milk I hate white milk I like chocolate milk even as a kid white milk will make me gag I don't know why. But those two, I, I will get cake butter, ice cream, ice cream, <laughs> ice cream. No, ice cream, cake butter, ice cream from Cold Stone. And I had a part. I had a full time job and a part time job, and Cold Stone was right there, like right near there. So I would go out to work. This is my one of my best friends who committed suicide, and uh, we would get ice cream together, peace and blessings, and. Sometimes my best friend will come with, and sometimes I will go alone. I'm like, I need a fix. I need my ice cream. And the cheesy bread at the time, best friend will come and bring them. Other times I will need it myself. But 
I everything else was easy for me to quit, like meat, milk, all that, because I was drinking regular chocolate milk. So when I started eating meat again, like I stated, I drank. I just introduced fish, turkey, and chicken. That's it. I don't eat anything else. So if I make a lasagna, you might say, hey guys, I made a lasagna. Excuse me. What it go? I made a ground turkey lasagna. If I make a taco soup, anything with like ground meat in it, it's made with ground turkey. <coughs> now, I do cook ground beef, but I don't eat it. I use my kids and they taste it, but like they cook, they, they, um, their dad, well, my, you know, their dad taught them, he's a chef, they taught them how to cook steaks. So. I don't eat it. So, my kids are teenagers. They know how to, they're beginner cooks. So, I taught them how to cook rice. Excuse me. Their dad, um, taught them how to cook a steak. So, they, uh, I'm not, even when I ate steak, I didn't like steak. You know what's an off the wall topic? You know what really grinds my gears? I went skydiving for the second time on a tandem jump. And it was cold as shit on Sunday. It was supposed to be on Saturday, but the weather wasn't permitting. I go Saturday, and that weather was like, it was cold. It was cold AF. This whole week has been nice. Do you know what a pissed off B-I-T-C-H I am? Very. Because skydiving has been a release for me for stress. I only done a tandem so far. Uh, I'm, believe it or not, I'm terrified of heights, but the jump, the, the, the drop, and then just looking at everything is so peaceful. Eventually, I, I do want to get certified. It was so freaking cold on Sunday. It was supposed to be 60. 60. 60 my ass. It wasn't 60. Every day after it's been 60. Do you know what? 59, 58, 57, 56 feels on your body? Going down, jumping off a plane with another individual at 120 miles per hour. It feels very cold, y'all. It feels very cold. Very freaking cold. I was like, man. I said, you know what? I don't know the guy. I believe in God. Or not. I said, well, you know what? God bless y'all. Because they do it year round when... It's not super duper cold and the weather permits.
Because when I get licensed, I did be out there in that cold weather. Y'all, I got arthritis in my lower, in my hip, and in my lower back. I got bad knees. I call myself not the Meg Stallion knees because my knees suck. My knees are terrible. It's when I'm sitting here right now, when I get up, you know what I'm going to say? Oi! Because my knees are going to be like, pop. And that's nobody's fault. That's just being a veteran. But, bruh. Mm -mm. Excuse me. What the? No. Mm -mm. Don't put them on. Without them on because there's no more liquid. No liquid has been absorbed. Well, bro, I, I can't do it. I said, God bless you. Like, you know, I'll be like, hey. Do you need someone to pack some some parachutes in the cold weather? I could do that. But jumping? This girl is not your girl because no. Nah. But anyway, I have enjoyed this week of making content every day. I think I've made content every day. Uh, my memory is terrible, so if you have been watching my videos and have any suggestions of other things that you would like to see, please let me know. I would love to hear it. I take constructive feedback very well, long as it's said politely. Let me know, please. I would love to know. I would love to see my channel grow eventually. And please know that you are amazing, you're beautiful, and this world is better with you in it. Have an amazing night or day. And your girl, Lena, out.